Hey, it's me. This is the pirate ship that I saw as I came into Portsmouth. I thought, that's just amazing. There's a pirate ship, wow. There's also this metal sail. I think it's supposed to be a sail, but I don't really know. But it's in Portsmouth, and the first time I saw it, I thought, that's amazing, I have to film that one day. And so I did today. And so I'll talk to you later. Hey, it's me. I'm back at Halls now. Um, as I was walking to Halls with my suitcase and laptop bag and stuff, um, I walked past a restaurant just around the corner from my halls um, that was closing down and they were selling everything inside and so once I dropped off my stuff I went back there with a friend um, and I was looking for a fridge, like just a small under the counter fridge um, like normal sized um, to go in my room because the fridge space in the kitchen there isn't very much um, and so I want, I want my own fridge so I can like, put a lot more in it because I can only buy like small amounts at the moment. Um, and so I went in there and they had four fridges um, and they said £30 for them. But they looked pretty manky so I didn't really want to pay £30. Um, I'm looking for one for free um, on a couple of websites. Um, so hopefully I'll be able to find one there. Uh, but they also had loads of other stuff. They were selling tills, glass, loads of glasses, chairs, tables, plates, cutlery, uh, casserole dishes, I nearly bought a casserole dish um, and like loads of stuff and I ended up going with some filing uh, trays I got three um, they, they usually have these on so they're like multi-stackable but this one didn't have one um, so I don't know what I'm going to do with that probably like put it underneath sideways or something I um, also got a Southern Comfort pitcher some cocktail stirrers, a whole box of them. I don't know if there are still a hundred in there. Um, and then I got a Coca-Cola glass and just a small Cobra glass. And I got all that for a fiver, which I thought was pretty good. Um, they also had loads of tills and uh, card machines and stuff as well. And like four, um, I should have got one actually. They had four, um, wireless routers um, so I could have got one of those and put it in my room oh well um, yeah so I, I looked at the tills and uh, the till roll and stuff for work um, but it wasn't suitable, it was too small um, we use a bigger size and so I will talk to you later hey it's me I've just got my TV out and uh, set it up I'm leaning back so it looks a lot bigger uh, a lot smaller but that's where I'd usually be to see my TV and it's a lot bigger. My other one was 17 inches and this one's 22. Um, and set it all up and then I looked on the back to plug in my Xbox and it doesn't have the right connection that I need. I need an HDMI cable so I'm going to get one in a couple of days. I've got that and I need an HDMI cable um, so I'll get that in a couple of days when I sell my old TV and a DVD in CEX. And I'm here with David at the moment. And we're going to go and get pizza and then go out. Do you want to go out? Don't mind. I don't know where we're going. We're going Keep to pubs. Few drinks. Yeah. We can, pre we can pre drink here or, or whatever. I'm and so I'll talk to you later. Hey, it's me. I'm at Halls. And I have just watched half of Captain America, the first Avenger. And I'm up to the... Actually, I'm not going to say which part I'm up to, just in case people haven't seen it. Um, but I've, I've just watched the very beginning of it. Um, and there's already so many things that I like about it. For one, it's Marvel, and it's part of the Avengers series, which is just amazing. I never really uh, watched Captain America, any of the cartoons or anything, when I was younger. So I didn't really know that much about it. But... I, I've picked up a couple of bits um, and some of the bits I loved in Captain America at the beginning were there's two scenes where he holds up a bin lid to protect himself as a shield and he also picks up a car door to protect himself as a shield and that's like foretelling his shield his, with the star on it and the um, red and white and blue um, and another thing is Tony Stark's dad, Howard Stark has made a couple of appearances in it and I find that amazing because it's like it's already linking in because it's set in the Second World War 
and so it's instead of Tony Stark like appearing in it, it's his father, which I think is brilliant. Um, and also the reason that I'm wearing this hat, you're probably wondering, is because I just made a video on my second channel. So I'll put the link to it down there so you can check that out. And I will talk to you later. Hey, it's me. And I'm just about to edit my video and then go to bed. And so, awesome thing of the day is this hat is really warm. This hat is awesome. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Goodbye. You've just watched Jack Catford.